Garlisle, you are becoming a nuisance. Hello everybody, welcome back to Rags to Wizard. We are joining our cow plant Garlisle out in front on a very lovely, lovely winter morning. Mm. Kenny, what are you doing? Why are you... Oh my goodness. I think, I think they're playing. It's okay. He's scolding Garlisle. He's saying, do not get snappy with me, young man. And Malia is calling. Let's see. Quick question. Jeffrey Landgrab and I were planning to spend some time together. Should I do it? Wait a minute. She is literally asking if she can spend time with Jeffrey Landgrab. And what does Kenny think? That Jeffrey Landgrab is very married. Why is she seeking Kenny out for extra marital affair advice? I don't feel comfortable. <laughs> With, with that, um, I'm gonna go ahead and say you probably shouldn't do that. That's not the kind of let's play I'm trying to play right now. We're, we're focusing on wholesome family fun. It's Monday morning. Pretty much everyone is off to work already, except for Amy and Devante, who uh, work from home. I was thinking for today we would focus more on Dustin and Nolan when they when they come back from work and you know we spent last episode a lot of time with Amy and I figured we could spend a little bit more time with Nolan and Dustin but we'll hang out with Devante and Amy while we're waiting for them to return from work I'll just get them painting and doing their yoga let's have Devante do a playful painting I'm starting to think that perhaps somewhere my greenhouse is not sound because everything is dead in here alrighty and here's our playful painting and it definitely is playful for sure let's sell it to a collector it's excellent quality definitely gives us a playful ambiance it's everything you ever wanted in a weird animal child eating a lollipop um i was gonna wait for nolan to get home to feed our chickens but they are very unhappy and very starving so we're gonna have Devante help us out here here you go chickens come and get it i feel like i haven't collected eggs in a while do we have eggs to collect and this is entirely too much food i don't know what i was thinking all right we got six eggs not bad Let's make sure that we put them away so that we don't lose them. We have, we actually have a hatchable egg. That's exciting. How does that work? Can I put the hatchable egg just back in the coop? I think that we are full of chickens. Oh, we have one more spot left. Okay. Hatchable egg it is. Nolan seems to be having a hard day at work. Oh, he's still drained from the cow plant. Um, during filming of the last episode, Nolan... No one got eaten by a cow plant, um, not by just any cow plant, but uh, Garlisle here. Nolan is still going to be recovering from that for the next few days. He's surviving. I wouldn't say Nolan's thriving, but he's definitely surviving. But speaking of thriving, it looks like Dustin just got promoted to mentor. Uh, so he will now make an additional $6 an hour for a grand total of $44 an hour. He's also received the following bonus, 525 simoleons, and the world is your oyster. Uh, so that's great. I love to hear that Dustin is, is thriving, and it looks like Kenny is feeling very excited. He's very energized. He wants to buy a treadmill. Kenny wants to do sit-ups now. Um, looks like Kenny is feeling athletic. We'll think it over. We just got the yoga set up, so maybe we have some room for fitness. But in the meantime, let's just have him feed and play with Garlisle um, so that, you know, we don't have an incident. But let's let's check in on Dustin. He is wearing a polka dot shirt. I don't ever remember giving him that. Why is he wearing that? Dustin, where did that shirt come from? And what? wait a minute. What happened to Dustin? Why does he have so many facial piercings? Okay, that cannot be ignored. We're, we're gonna go into Cass and we're gonna fix Dustin. I don't know what has happened to him. Okay, where where have things gone wrong? So this is Dustin's every day, which seems very normal. That's his formal. I don't recall choosing this outfit. That's normal. His party wear is normal. His swim wear is, I mean, they're long. They're a little long. Um, his hot weather wear seems fine. And his cold weather wear, where did, where, where? did all of these piercings and such come from? Those are our options. These are not very good. Okay, uh, sir? <laughs> I was not expecting this. It's a little short. This one's fun. Yeah, let's go with a jogger. 
Okay, we'll go with that. I mean, this outfit can't be from him being a mentor, can it? I just, I just don't get it. I'll just have him change into like normal people clothes because I don't know where this red spotted shirt came from. Here, we'll just have him change into his everyday outfit. Looks like a very sad Nolan is also back from work and he is just enjoying his mac and cheese. Poor buddy, he's, he's definitely had a hard couple of days. All right, so let's take a look at what everyone needs to do. Oh, Emily is calling us back. Humor and hijinks festivals are the best. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna set the hijinks festival out this time. I know it's a good time. We're just, we're just not gonna do it today. And it looks like Dustin's feeling a little sleepy. He has to grade his homework. Oh goodness. Like, I don't know if Nolan was playing with the cow plant and that's how he got eaten. Now every time I see someone hanging out with Garlisle, I get a little nervous. Let's see what Nolan has to do for his job. So we need to reach level two of the programming skill and tinker with the robot station. So maybe we can work on the programming skill. I'm not really sure how active poor Nolan is feeling right now. But maybe we practice programming, he'll feel a little bit better. I wish that I could get rid of that moodlet. Oh, looks like oh, he's having a bad day. Looks like someone must have walked in on him at the, in the bathroom as well. Poor Nolan. But if we can get our programming skill up and then we can tinker at the robotic station once he's starting to feel a little bit better. And good old Dustin just grading his papers. I'm gonna have Devante start another painting. Let's do a flirty painting, why not? All right, well, it's getting pretty late and Dustin and Nolan are sound asleep. So let's let's check back in with uh, Amy and Devante. They definitely are uh, the night owls of the group. Looks like Devante finished his flirty painting and it looks like we got some heart-shaped chocolate. That's very fun. Let's go ahead and sell that to a collector as well. Let's just do a landscape painting while we're out here. I know it's very late, but at least we can get started on it. Oh no, this is dangerous. <laughs> this is literally the scariest thing. Um, let's have let's have Amy feed Garlisle so nobody accidentally takes this cake and gets eaten. All right, well, it all seems to be all safe. Uh, Amy did a great job feeding him. Uh, no one was eaten. I unfortunately was too busy taking screenshots to actually commentary through there, so. Uh, but every every everything was fine. Everything's okay. Everyone is okie dokie. Amy's a dancing machine, and it's very late. Amy, I think you need to go to bed. So we're gonna send everyone off to bed, and then we will start fresh in the morning. Okie dokie. I'm gonna rise and shine, everyone. I'd say that you know Nolan's almost completely refreshed. Hopefully he's gonna start feeling better. We got 12 hours left until he starts feeling more like himself, and um, I'm gonna have him start working on his robotics. Oh, we just joined Nolan smacking himself in the face with a hammer, but he seems to be fine. He likes it, it's okay. Uh, so we wanna get his tinkering in before he has to go to work. So he goes in at nine, we got a couple hours. So if we do our daily tinker, that should get us uh, hopefully promoted. He's doing really good in his career. Oh my. So you see, Amy, I'm really good at tinkering. I have my fire here and uh, I use this to create the robots. Yeah, yeah, Nolan, it's it's really good, but do you think that working on robots with fire at six in the morning is a good idea? Just don't burn the house down. Silly, Amy, I won't burn the house down. I'm a genius and I hit stuff with hammers. Let's see, I'm gonna have Dustin work from home today. I think that that would uh, be really good for us. We're spending some more time with everybody today, so we need to create a lesson plan. Just go ahead and ignore Nolan smacking himself in the face. I assume that one day he'll be better at this and he won't do that anymore. For Dustin, we need to create a lesson plan and oh my goodness, Nolan, I think it's time to stop with the tinkering. It seems dangerous now, bud. Dustin, create a lesson plan. Ask for, ask to volunteer. So we can do that. We can do all of those things. Let's check in with Dustin now. Okay, Dustin, buddy, we need to create a lesson plan. And to do that, I believe we need to be on the computer. Uh, we also are just gonna enjoy the dancing stylings of Kenny in the background. And then with Nolan, we're also going to have him work from home. So. To do that, we just need to repair something and practice programming. Nolan's also uncomfortable because uh, he probably smacked himself in the face with a hammer too many times, to be completely fair. 
Uh, looks like, oh no, I keep missing this. It looks like Devante was also drained by the cow plant. Garlisle is becoming very dangerous and Devante just got eaten as well. I don't know how much longer Garlisle is going to be with us before I uh, make him live somewhere else. I just wanted to let you know I followed your advice and chose not to spend more time with Jeffrey Landgrab. Oh, okay, that's good to know. I'm very upset that Devante got eaten. Devante cannot die. There is no way he can die. I can't let that happen. Oh, our chickens are stinky. Um, well, we have a very smelly chicken. Nolan's still uh, recovering and, uh, oh my goodness, this hen house is reeking of green hen smells, apparently. Okay, Nolan's definitely having a bad time. Oh, it's Winterfest coming up. Well, that's just like in real life. It's almost real life Winterfest. Okay, I'm gonna have Nolan work on his programming. Let's see, Dustin, how's that lesson plan coming? It seems to be very time consuming. Well, he should finish that soon and then we will have him maybe eat something. There we go, we got that. Um, let's have him, maybe we'll just have him have some brunch. There we go, Dustin has made himself a delicious lunch of uh, scrambled eggs and toast and bacon. I feel like having him work from home is a little bit more challenging than having him actually go into work. And then it also looks like we need to up our debate skill. That's something we don't necessarily have to do today. So we're gonna, we're gonna work on the volunteering. Unidentified invader. During Kenny's daily tending routine, they came across a particular looking plant hidden amongst the rest. Kenny is excited at the discovery of the new species, but he knows it could be deadly to the ecosystem. Does Kenny break the possibly ecological disaster and let the plant grow or does he play it safe and quarantine the specimen to protect the other plants? I'm gonna say quarantine because I feel like that's just the word of the year and you know it's probably a good idea. Kenny took the plant and placed it in a confined part of the lab to quarantine. Kenny moved it just in time as the plant grew out of control taking up all the space within its quarantine. Due to Kenny's quick thinking, no other plants in the lab were damaged and this unruly invader has been dispatched accordingly. Performance gain small. That is good. Oh no. No, no, no. No. Dustin, no. Maybe this is what happens. Like maybe they go and like play with them and then and then they get eaten. I don't even know. Oh no. I don't like this. Garlisle, if you kill one of my sims, I'm sorry, bud, you're gonna have to go. Oh gosh. I mean he's really cute. It's just it's just not it's just not a good time. Let's let's just have Dustin work on his career stuff. I think I'm gonna ask Patchy to volunteer time. Like maybe that's a good thing for us to do. I'm not sure if I'm asking Patchy if I can volunteer my time to Patchy or if I'm asking Patchy to volunteer time to me. So I'm not really sure. Hey Patchy, would you like to volunteer? I feel like either me or you spending extra time doing things is a good idea. So we did it. I don't know what it means. I don't know if I'm helping Patchy now or if he's helping me, but uh, we we did it. We, we did the jobs for the day. Uh, and it is, it's only three in the afternoon. So with that, Dustin can practice debate and we can spend a little bit more time with Nolan who's still feeling pretty bad. We did up our programming skill. I think we got to level three and then we need to repair something. Luckily, there's always something broken here. So I'm sure we can find something that he can repair. Oh, somehow Kenny's earned a raise. Kenny has been given a raise to PhD of pollen for superior work performance. He will now make an additional $10 an hour for a grand total of $460 an hour. Perfect, here's something broken that we can repair. We can repair this toilet. We can repair this toilet. Why are all of our toilets constantly super broken? Like all the time. All right, and Nolan has reached level four of the handiness skill and we are working on our repairing work. We're almost done with our day. He should get a promotion tomorrow and it looks like our fridge is broken and leaking water everywhere which seems very dangerous so we're gonna have our magical sims fix that because we definitely do not want to take the chance of having one of these guys electrocuted. I feel like setting it on fire is not the answer. Oh 
he's maxed the handiness skill. Okay, Kenny, you can fix that. I'm sure you're fine. We're gonna save the game first because just in case this doesn't work out, we can just go back like it didn't happen. I'm not above cheating in that way. Okay, and in other news, uh, Devante has also reached level 10 of uh, the painting skill. So that's exciting for Devante. And then Kenny, I'm gonna have you, buddy, can you make everyone dinner? I feel like everyone is struggling. Here, let's do a lovely, Let's do a, a lovely chicken stir fry. I feel like everyone would like that. And job wise, everyone is good to go. So I'm very pleased with everybody. Devante is now level 10 of gardening, painting. Not bad, bud. Oh my goodness. Garlisle is dangerous again. Okay, let's have, um, well, let's let's maybe have Dustin come feed him today. See, we don't eat the cake. I almost clicked on that. That's so scary. We're just gonna feed him a bunch. I don't know, maybe he just has unbridled hunger. This is just not safe. Having, having Garlisle in our front yard is not safe. I should have gotten like another pet and named it Garlisle because this man is very dangerous. Oh, Devante just finished a masterpiece? Really? Wow, that's beautiful. So let's maybe sell that to an art gallery. He hasn't painted a masterpiece for a while, so that's really, that's really cool. I wonder how his star is doing? It's almost there. I don't even know how you get to be famous. Like, does he just have to Simstagram a bunch? Maybe we'll just have him do that. Here, Simstagram too, buddy. Look at him taking them selfies. How many followers does he have? Like two? Yeah, he has 12. Good job. I'm very excited for Nolan to get... Oh my... Kenny, what happened here? I'm very excited for Nolan to get promoted tomorrow. I feel like he's worked on that a really long time. Let's get all these sims to bed so that we can get Nolan promoted. Keeping an eye on Garlisle because I just... I'm starting to not trust my man over here. It also seems like... Wait, what is happening? We have a floating cake. Hello? How did that even get there? That's not where that was before. Okay, we're just gonna put it there. I'm not gonna mess with it right now. Nolan, I thought you were in bed, buddy. What are you doing? He's playing Sims forever. Okay, I think it's time to go to bed, my dude. Go to sleep. We got a big date. It's one in the morning, Nolan. Go to bed. Oh, you've already slept. You slept early. Well, it's nighttime, dude. We got a super speed. Well, it's starting to snow, and I actually, I don't know if Garlisle can live through snow. Um, so I guess we'll find out. Hmm, we should be able to, uh, milk some essences soon as well. Oh, it looks like we have a chicken that's hatching. That's exciting. Got a little chicky chick. Let's see. I would say, Nolan, you're good. Let's, let's take care of your chickens. Let's scatter some food. Let's collect the eggs. Let's hatch your eggs. Do all of our chicken duties. We should probably put the eggs from yesterday away. They're about to spoil. I guess I could sell them. We'll sell them. I don't think we need the eggs. It's nice to have their, our own eggs, but at this point, I don't think we need them. Oh, look at that. Nolan has a new friend. Little chicken, very sweet. Very nice, good job, Nolan. Good chickening. Dustin is still getting his beauty sleep. Let's put Dustin's new poster on the wall too while we, while we have his undivided attention. It's very nice. Um, I'm not sure if there's any swatches on this. We just hang it above his bed. Ah, uh, this does not have any swatches. Well, that's fine. Alrighty, everyone. Thank you so much for watching this very Nolan and Dustin centric episode of Rags to Wizard. I really like these latest episodes where I've spent a little bit more time focusing on certain sims in the family. And I think that that's a really good way for us to spend time with them, get to know them and play. So this week we spent more time with Dustin and Nolan had them work from home so that we could do a little bit more gameplay, got them promoted, and Nolan is gonna get promoted the next time we play. We had another little Garlisle incident where Devante got eaten. Again, we didn't capture it. We're not sure what has happened, but uh, Garlisle is becoming a nuisance and um, that's unfortunate. So we just have to keep a, a bigger eye on him, I guess. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. It really does help out. And if you like Sims content, give me a follow. I post new Sims videos every Monday and I will see you all in the next one. Goodbye.